Hello guys and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to solve the 2x2. Two two. Now I know I already made a video on how to solve the 2x2, two two, but I thought I would make a new one because the other one I wouldn't, I didn't say the notations for the algorithms. And this one I will say the notations. And I'll make it a lot clearer for you guys to understand. So let's just mix this up here. Give it a good scramble. Okay, so once it's scrambled, guys, first thing you'll need to do, no algorithms for this step, but all you'll need to do is solve white any way you want. So I'm just going to turn this, connect and make a bar. You can make it however you want. I just think this is the easiest. Okay, once you have white solved, you don't need anything solved at this point right now. Once you have white solved, you're, what, you're going to face white down, white face is down, and you're going to look on the bottom first layer for any two colors that match up. Here's one, green and green. Now it could be any color, it could be orange and orange, it could be red and red, or it could be blue and blue, it doesn't matter. And what you're going to do, if you have none, you'll do a different algorithm. But if you have one, you'll do this algorithm, and I'll show you the different algorithm. I'm just going to show you this one. So you have two. The two that are matched up hold to your left side. Hold to your left side. And then bring, do R, U, R prime, U, two. And then look over here. Bring the r prime u r u prime r prime u now go back to your white face and white is now done with the first layer done as well now once you have the first layer done with white still you're gonna have white facing down and then you're gonna look first layer then you're gonna go on red you're going to go on the first layer of red. doesn't have to be solved. could be, but it doesn't have to. Usually it isn't. And then you're going to look up on your upper layer. And you're going to look for yellow pieces. Here's one. If you have two, let's say this blue here was a yellow. Then you would hold it on the right side like this. But since you only have one yellow, you need to hold it in the bottom left corner. And you need to do this algorithm. R. U. R prime, U, R, U two, R prime. Now, as you can see, yellow will be done. Now, sometimes I only did it once. Usually, you have to do it twice, three times, even sometimes like six times. But I was just lucky that time. And then what you're gonna need to do is look on the bottom layer, on the second layer, if any colors match up. No. But then look for the two other bars that connect. Here's a color. Sometimes you won't have any colors. And every single color will look like this. You'll have three colors. And then this one will be not matched up. So like this will look like all in all of them. But in this case, we have the full color match done. Now once you have the full color, you'll need to do the same algorithm as you would if you have these. Except you'll need to, you can hold it as any way you want if you have this. But when you have this full matched color, you'll need to do it different positioned way. Now, um, if you have it like this, you'll do the same algorithm as I was saying, but just you'll need to do it twice instead of once. So, if you have one color like this, I'll just show you what it would look like without one. Okay, so without one color being done, oops, I accidentally did it with color. So you'll do the same algorithm, but let's say it was all like that. You can hold it any way you want, but since there's one color solved, it could be any color. This instance, it's orange. It was green, but I just tried to get it like this, but it didn't work. So hold orange in the back layer. So orange in the back in the opposite color, which is red. So whatever the opposite color, which is red, 
You'll need to hold it on the opposite color that is matched up and soft. And you're gonna do this algorithm. L prime, no, L sorry. F prime, L. And you're gonna look up here. Do U2, L prime, D, L, U2. Then you're gonna do R2. Then you're gonna look up here and do U. Or sometimes you need to do a U2. And then your cube is solved. Good job. Congratulations. You solved your first Rubik's Cube. Now I'm gonna try and get it a mix up that we would show you. So guys, back to when you're solving white and when you're solving the first layer, if you had no two colors match up, you're gonna do this quick, easy up. You're gonna do R2, U2, R2. And it doesn't matter how you hold it. Like, you see, it was like this, none colors were matched up. You can hold it any way you want. You can hold it this, 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 or this. Doesn't matter. Whatever is fastest, and then do the algorithm. And now they're all done.